guys. How are you guys doing? Hopefully good, hopefully good. Um, I hope y'all have a good um, weekend this weekend and y'all have a great day off tomorrow, which is Monday. Um, trying to remember what the holiday is. It's September the 5th. Y'all know that holiday. I can't, I can't think what the hell holiday it is right now. Uh, Labor Day? Labor Day. Hope you have a wonderful Labor Day weekend, you guys. And I can give you something, you know, to help y'all along your journey. Thank you for all your loyal support and help. And I appreciate you guys. And I'm going to give a deck away at 500. And I'm on my way. And I thank you guys. And I love you. And I appreciate you very much. And, well, let's get into it and see what kind of energy pulls out tonight. These are uh, new messages that I got um, out of my hat box for you guys. So hopefully, hopefully somebody will get something from it, okay? I appreciate y'all for your comments and your support and uh, especially uh, y'all subscribing to me. I, I greatly appreciate you and I hope I can just be, uh, uh, give you all enough courage to go after your eyes goes and dreams because that's, that's, that's my main focus to you guys. Uh, we all have this power inside of us. We just got to unleash it. That's all you can do, you guys. Uh, that's what I did. I, I found out I'm stronger than most of these people on earth. Uh, I went through a lot of things and I've learned I'm, I'm pretty damn tough. Pretty damn tough now. I figured it out. Hey, you guys. What is it that the people's needs to know for the days to live up your soul? What the whole place? I love my butt ache so much. Love my people so much. I love my family, you guys. I do anything for them, I just want y'all to know that. To know we, we went, that's enough, you guys. We went enough. We went enough for us, okay? Let's see what it's telling us. Let's see what it's telling us today, you guys. Excuse how I look. It's Sunday night, like. Probably like 10.30, I guess. I just wanted to come in here and do a reading. That's when I feel uh, spirits spirits help me more to uh, convey the message better. I know it's uh, near, near the night. You know, but I mean, I do a lot of readings during the day. I just know that it helps during the night, too, a lot. I've noticed. I'll, I'll, I'll give a lot of good messages that y'all like during the night time, and that's why I'm doing it, okay? So, um, all this stuff laid out right here, it says wings of light. I'm starting here. It said, you're becoming something new at the moment. Uh, this is about your wisdom uh, you, you, and you learning uh, that you're just a joy to be around. You you like art and music. Uh, you're grateful. You're, you're very optimistic at the moment. You've got a joyous view of your future. Woo! Good. Peace. Hit subscribe if you're new. Uh, you're flying over all that down karma. You're flying high, baby. You're flying into that sacred pool of wisdom that's inside of each and every one of us. You took sacred action. You got a straight, decisive focus about yourself. And that's why River of Blessings is coming, because you release strength, constraints with all whatever it is, you know, that y'all have to release. And the Spirit appreciates you. And uh, you're, you're educating people at the moment. That's why education come out. That's why you're coming to life. I mean, this is my life purpose is to educate, you know. And these goblins around it think they can steal everything. You're healing them. That's why healing earth come under goblins, you know. You got the power to give and receive healing. You're healing goblins. You're even healing them old little old goblins running amok. Uh, these goblins that are narcissists and uh, 
these overt narcissists, they'll even show you that they're a narcissist on their channel when they're like, when they say people's coming up against me and I think I'm better. You're just telling yourself that you're a narcissist. I don't do that. I'm not telling anybody I'm better than anybody, but nobody's going to steal stuff from me. They're listening to you. They're listening to everything you say and they write it down and maybe you're listening to music at the moment and... But all I know is your treasure is protected. That's why I come out. You had the courage and strength to stand up for your, and the veracity to stand up for your family. Good for you. That's how you, that's how you got power over all these difficulties. You're reclaiming your power at the moment. You got sacred sens sensuality about yourself. This is about your feminine wisdom and the passion that's inside of us. Your God, your pipe got illuminated. This is what you're meant to do. You're healing earth. You're a God that's healing earth. Look. You're a guy that's healing earth. Look, see your see your light powers. See your light powers. Maybe your star seed like me or an earth angel. Or both. And you know, that's, that's why you're gonna have abundance, fortune, wealth, of plenty. It's coming to you. And that's what old Collie Ma says too. She says, Hey, see me in my four down arms? That's why I can get so much done. You know. And I like that spirit now. Now let's tell this. Was this how many messages I pulled out, you guys? Wow, that's a lot of messages. It says sometimes you need to look to the stars and get your guidance. See, see, I love my cards. It's true. Somebody needs to listen to that. No one, no one as amazing as you has ever been interested in in me. That's what somebody saying. Somebody saying nobody as amazing as you has ever been even liked me. They love at you uh, teaching about this star guidance. Uh, and they felt like a wounded little warrior because uh, maybe maybe they didn't pay you no mind or something and you just moved on without them. Now they're feeling it. They're feeling it. And uh, they wish they would have told you it is amazing. And three strikes and they're out of there. God won't let you get hurt by these people anymore. They're not allowed to hurt the chosen ones. I love you, Spirit. So whoever's hurt you, Spirit's taking them out. Three strikes, they're out. So whoever keeps hurting you and taking from you and from your family legacy, three strikes. They're on their second. They got one more strike. Your eyes are so beautiful. Ooh, and people say they're hungry eyes. They mesmerize me, Divine Feminine. Somebody said you're hungry eyes now. God Almighty, they never see such hungry eyes, they said. It said you finally saw through the smoke and mirrors. It was all an illusion. So, I mean, this person that was, they acted like they weren't interested in you, you know, and you maybe you thought it was an illusion, and now they're feeling wounded. Well, because they didn't take action, I guess. Whoever his story's for, it says, fight with fire. This wounded little warrior might be trying to fight with fire, with fire now. Three strikes, you're out. The angels are on your side. They're always there helping you see the foul ones all around i love you that's so true spirit that's so true that my angels always show me who the foul ones are they they can't lie they tell on herself these narcissists there's a lot of narcissist tarot readers women women you gotta learn that you're a narcissist okay your eyes are so beautiful and hungry eyes somebody that lives in california they said god you got a lot of guidance and you've helped these people and they appreciate you whoever you are in california and i do know a reader in california and i appreciate you i love you and oh um uh, you know for for your work that you do in society not in a creepy way <laughs> it says uh oh so now you want me since you see me succeeding so this person you know that you thought was an illusion they act like they weren't interested in you now they're, they're interested because they want your money maybe and the law has your back in this whole situation so chill so it's when the little warriors trying to fight fire with fire the law is watching them so don't worry about it three strikes you're out the angels are on your side and your karmics are hating on you because you know how to rise above all their bullshit lies <laughs> and by the skin of your teeth you'll escape the snares of the devil yeah you will and um it says i'm jealous as hell but i won't admit it this person's jealous of you that you're succeeding huh and somebody that lives in georgia uh the law has your back in this situation these people that's trying to fight fire with fire the law's got your back don't worry people in georgia it says please don't hate me because i'm beautiful judge me for my inner self of self-love that's what i'm saying don't hate me because i'm pretty judge me for my inner self of self-love that's what i'm saying 
And people keep trying to steal your joy, but don't let them, but don't let them steal your joy. You just keep going, girl. You just keep going, girl, up there in California. You're doing good. And it says, if I only had one day with you, I would definitely make you fall in love with me. So now it's the person that made you feel like it was an illusion. Oh, now they're wanting to make, they're wanting to make you fall in love with them now. Now that's up to you all. I'm not telling y'all what to do. I'm not, I'm not that person. I'll, I'll read you things that's happened to me. If you get something from it, good. That's what I'm wanting y'all to do. I'm wanting y'all to guide your way, guide your way the way that the, that you're meant to do okay do good and that's all i'm asking you all it says you need to heal and deal and forgive and be your best authentic self person in georgia it says every time you pass by this lady whether driving or passing in the grocery store she throws her head in the opposite direction because she knows all the shit that she was saying was a bunch of nothing see so these people they tell on themselves Somebody that lies on you, they will not look you in the eyes. Let me tell you something. Somebody that lies to you will not fucking look you in the eyes. If they went around lying and slandering your name, they will not look you in the eyes. They'll look, they'll be like, hey, 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 hey. and when you turn, like, turn and they'll look at you. That's how you know, okay? I, I'm not telling you all my lie secrets. I know way, way more than that, but I'm not, I'm not speaking of it. Uh, it breaks the heart of many when he or she died. So... Somebody that died out in California. It must might have been a star. And it broke everybody's heart when they died. It says dark skies are hovering around their heads when they walk outside. So this person is, uh, they wish they had one day with you. Now it's just dark, gloomy, doomy all around. <laughs> and spirits wake you up at 111, 222, or four four every morning. They're wanting you to pay attention to your dreams. They're trying to tell you something. And make your hobby up your passion, you guys, and build a business and grow it into that into a brand new you. Are you listening? Whatever y'all's hobby is. Somebody's arrogant, egotistical, and do you want to fight? Somebody's wanting to fight you now. Uh somebody's wanting to fight you and cause your eyes are so beautiful. And you get your guidance from the stars. And when does all the damn gossiping stop? Huh. I don't know. Somebody got that juicy ice now. It says somebody got that juicy ice, and it says, uh, "Master of Illusion, Alakazam, bippity boppity boo. I will make a magical concoction and throw it back to you, magician. Uh, so you're you're uh, the master. You're the master of illusion. You're making your hobby your passion. You're." And you're building a business all up. Good for you. You're a good magician. That's what I did. It said someone sees the potential in you. Somebody out in California sees the potential in you. They know you're doing good, babies. Balance, restored, rest assured. Do you hear that? Out in Montana, somebody got that juicy ass. They won't fight far with far, and the law has you back. Now, listen. If somebody is pregnant and they wanted a child for a long time now, somebody out here did now. I don't know who it is. It ain't me, you guys. I just wrote that card for you all. It says, check your Venus sign. California, check your Venus sign. Pay attention to the readings. You're going to get a read this week and it's going to pertain to you. And some, uh, it's really going to hit home. Someone's scared that they will be treated like shit again. So this person that you moved away from, they they want you back now, and, and they're and, but they're scared they're gonna be treated like shit, or you're scared of it. But God sees straight through the enemy. He upholds the righteous. So this person wants to fight fire with fire. This little wounded warrior that's why it's in red. You better check your Venus sign, little wounded warrior, and not be fighting fire with fire, cause God sees you shit. He's telling you right now. The one who laughs last, they have the best life. <laughs> Ain't that true? That's a truest saying. It says someone is building a new life on their own. So somebody out in California, you're building a new life on your own. And leave your friends in the dust. You must have left these friends in the dust. And they wish they'd you come around again, but they know that. But you know that you're going to get treated like bullshit. That's why balance rest. Balance restored, rest assured. That's why that happened. So I don't know if you want them around you again because they they mirror, they make things an illusion. Are you listening? There's a hater around you. There's a hater around you, and God sees straight through their bullshit. You need to watch your back. 
Somebody needs to watch their back out here, it says. Invest in yourself and all will go in your favor. And it feels like you've been trampled over by a thousand people. I'd hate to be the ones that done these spells on you because they are reaping what they sowed. <laughs> so if you if it felt like a thousand people was trampling on your back, 25,000 is going to be trampling on their back now. <laughs> oh, ain't that funny? Somebody sees the potential in you. No one has... No one as amazing as, as you has ever been interested in me, somebody said. Uh, you need to heal and deal and forgive and be your best authentic self. Someone that lives in Georgia. This person wants to fight fire with fire. The law has your back in this situation. You finally saw through all these smoke and mirrors. It was an illusion. This wounded little warrior. This wounded little warrior. You need to look to the stars and get your guidance and invest in yourself and then you'll be feel better and somebody is building life on their own now uh person out in california it says uh hang on a minute uh it said if i only had one day with you i'd definitely make you fall in love with me that's what somebody said now to you out in california they said your eyes is so beautiful and they're hungry eyes and they mesmerize this person now divine feminine divine feminine it says when does all the damn gossiping stop they're jealous of hell but they won't admit it to you oh so now y'all want me now since you see us succeeding yeah and the angels are on your side. They are always there helping you see the foul ones around. So don't worry. People out in Montana, are you listening? Uh, there's a hater around you, sis. And God sees straight through this enemy. And somebody got that juicy butt. And uh, dark skies are hovering around their heads when they walk outside. Three strikes. You're on your second. Third strike, you're out. Your karma... Your karmics is hated because you know how to rise above all their bullshit. That's why. Because you're you're the master magician. You make your hobby a passion and you built your business by it. And this woman that can't even look you in the eye because she's a lying bitch and you know it. And please don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Judge me for my inner self of loving all of myself and all my wrongs. Why can't why can't people do that? Because they're arrogant and egotistical and they always want to fight. It breaks the heart of many when this person dies. Fuck. People keep trying to steal your joy, but don't let them get you down. Keep going, girl. By the skin of your teeth, you will escape the snares of the devil. Like me, because you left your friends in the dust. These bullshit narcissists. And someone's scared that they'll be treated like shit again. You need to check your Venus signs and pay attention to your Venus readings. And it feels like you've been trampled on by a thousand. Well, these people that hated on you and sent spells for you, they're going to have 25,000s. On her back now, trampled by 25,000 people. And spirits that wake you up, they're they're trying to warn you that you needed to watch your back. But they're wanting you to know the one who likes life has the best life. <laughs> this person's pregnant now. <laughs> that's why, uh, and, and you're somebody that's balanced because you, when it balance restored, rest assured. Okay? All right, you guys. Let me pick up all these and put them back and we'll see something that my eyes just tell us. And uh, maybe I'll do a tarot reading and see what it says. I'll do a tarot reading. Here's you guys this tarot reading today. Okay, you guys let me we'll use my deck. Uh, lady, let me shift them of course real good. Oh there's a knight of ones and a king of ones now. Fiery passionate. And there's more wand energy. It's a lot of fire energy out there. Remember it said fight fire with fire. You might have to fight fire with fire. You know, what's what's good for the goose is good for the gander. You ever heard that old saying? Well, it's in the south a lot. 1919. So whatever the goose does, the gander goose can do it too. The woman goose. <laughs> okay, what what do you know? What what what's uh my collective need to know today, spirit? What's the collective need to know today, spirit? That there's a that that uh, there's some loving, caring, and empathetic, intuitive mother figure that's in your life at the moment. Maybe Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces that wants to talk to you. Pages towards this Earth, air energy. Oh, uh, 
mother, based on some unforeseen events that's uh, getting ready to take place. Um, this is about someone's hesitating to come towards you. They see you persevering at the moment. They're observing you. There's some younger energy around watching everything you do, moms. Are you listening? Oh, yeah, this one fell out first. And, and, and then we got King of Coins. This is Iron Earth energy. Uh, maybe this Queen of Cups is married to this Earth sign. Uh, they're observing uh, your rationale at the moment, whoever this is. Uh, but this is a falsicity. This is somebody that is false. They're very intelligent, and they're, you better be certain that they're your rival. So whoever this King of Coins is, it's a rival against you. Are you listening? And it's it's a devil. The, the devil's on these. The devil's on them. Uh, they don't know how to clean up their subconscious. Uh, they're, they're attracted to you. They see that you're liberating people. They got the audacity to fuck with you. They have the audacity to mess with your life. But uh, this is about your willpower and overcoming these devilish temptations in your life. These are arrogant, possessive, dependent, drug drug life people. That's why devil card come out. So, uh, so it's this Queen of Cups. Uh, went around talking. That's why swords come out. You know, that's the communication. They went around communicating false, falsely to this Earth sign. Maybe you like this King of Coins, you know, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, and and they was making it, making uh, the, they was trying to make you feel insecure, like this person didn't want you. That's what us. Now listen, what else? Oh, but whoever is what, whoever this is up here is King of Coins or is Queen of Cups or the Devil Capricorn. They're in their nightmares now. They're in their nightmares of you ever night. It's nice. Swords is more as Gemini energy. You got a new awareness about this. You took the willpower to stand up. You started reflecting on how to show up in this world. This whoever this person is, they're they're wounded and they they waste their life. They they waste their life. You know whoever this is. Ooh, spit it. Oh, and uh, they uh. They can't stop thinking about you. Six of Cups. Uh, this is about memories. Uh, you know, maybe you, you're going through a renewal at the moment. Uh, they can't stop thinking about the past. And um, maybe they're in solitude or you're in solitude. But they're, they're doubting. They're doubting that. They're doubting that. They have a. They're doubting that you're going to receive justice. That's what it is. King of Swords. And King of Swords is, uh, you know, somebody that can be cold and they can be very dominating, but, you know, there's someone who is very secure and, you know, uh, They also bring about justice. So justice is coming. This could be someone in the law enforcement. This could be uh, law enforcement is, uh, and then we got Page of Cups. They are watching you in your new beginning, and, and they're curious about you. Uh, they actually love you, and whoever this person is, um, they're inexperienced. This young energy, this earth and water energy, they're they're inexperienced, and they're envious and jealous of you. And it's this Queen of Cups. That's why Cups come out again. She's jealous of you. She's jealous of your beginning. She's jealous of it. And uh, they're watching everything you do. That's why observation is on this. Uh, you, you moved away from this person, I guess. This Cancer. It could have been a Cancer that you moved away from. Cups, Cups, Chariot. Uh, this can also be a Law. You may be getting a new car, too, but... Uh, you took action and to control your thoughts about this, maybe this earth sign. Uh, you're going to triumph. You're getting ready to travel. This is about charisma. And uh, maybe you're getting ready to partner up in a business venture with someone. This is about taking the efforts to get over all these obstacles. Okay? That's what this is talking about. So, uh, this Queen of Cups can't stop watching. That's what it is. Uh, she's jealous. She's jealous. And she's mad that she couldn't keep control, 
keep controlling you, like controlling your narrative. And this key, key, key of uh, pinnacles up here is key of coins. Uh, they want to have a victory and success with you. Uh, they want to have a victory with you. They want to feel ecstasy. They want to make love to you. They want to be, they want to feel openness with you. But they've been repressing their feelings and they, they're waiting on you. They just keep waiting on you to do, do everything. And they need to clean up. They, they're very attracted to you, but they need to liberate their self from this Queen of Cups, whoever she is. And they know that your wish fulfillment, maybe you helped them. Uh, maybe you got a victory over drugs. And if you did out here, I love you guys. Yeah, and I hope so. But somebody thinks that, ooh, your wish fulfillment, you know, this is nine of cups, Jupiter, Pisces, energy, and, and uh, this is about motherhood and your ideals and secrets and quarrels and happiness. You're just happy, your wish fulfillment. You can tell your secrets, and that's why Ten of Pentacles come out, you know. This is Mercury Virgo energy, and this is about somebody, um, somebody that... You might live with it could be a Gemini or a Virgo that is that you had a disagreement with at some time but I mean y'all must have got through it they was they was feeling uncertain about you and that's why they was up with their nightmares and but uh, this is about your home and your abundance and savings so I mean ten of pentacles is good but you want to see the ten cups ten cups ten cups they can't stop thinking about you and all your all's memories together and and uh, nine of wands this moon is Sagittarius they're, they're protecting you at the moment and they're warning you danger but you all uh, resolution you all resolved your issues you're accepting uh, that this was just a risk that you try to take and that's why it felt like waiting and waiting and setbacks you understand because it y'all was just going through something you know Hang on. Oh wow! And this and uh, this person that loves you is, could be this Virgo. They can, uh, they want to tell you that they can't stop thinking about how much they love you. That they, they keep they keep thinking about you over because you're a real empress, you know. And a real empress is loving, caring, nurturing, giving, fruitful, abundant, and very creative, you know. This is about seduction and dynamism. Dynamism, dynamism. Dynam dynamism. This is about. Uh, it could be about inner turmoil. Also, it's also what uh, empress means. But all it means is you've poured out your love onto all these people, and they know that you're uh, making your own. That you're bringing something into fruition at the moment, and that you're very creative and and that you're building your security you're building your security and it's pissing this other woman off over here this woman and man that's getting in your business and you just feel cold and detached probably because you know it's backstabbing betrayal you know this is about your total vision and cruelty resignation solitude so maybe you had to re resign from a job and go into solitude you know because, uh, you know, your secrets got out, you know. People want to laugh and go tell everything, and, you know. And it's funny that Queen of Cups and King of Coins come out right here because I know what people do to me and I know what your down signs are, you know. So that's why it's funny to me. What are our Queen of Cups? Um, Eight of Swords, Jupiter, Gemini, uh... There's no apparent claim of meddling at the moment. Uh, they're they're hiding they're hiding this. They can't stop concentrating on you. You're you're pissing them off. They're they're in a lot of frustration at the moment. And and they they wanted some they wanted something to happen to you. That's why unforeseen events come out. That's why they keep observing you. And you moved away from this person and you started becoming a successful business owner on your own. You had a farsightedness about all this situation. You've seen it way in advance before they did. This is on. It's about you're on your conquest and and whoever was uh, against you and they might have been trying to fraud your identity. There's consequences to this fraud. You know that, right? <laughs> and you might be getting a new car, baby. What on our king of king coins? Four of swords. Uh,
this rival of yours, uh, you're you're gonna have a victory over this person if they're an earth sign, man or woman. You're gonna have a victory over them because they cannot fuck with your stability and your peace or your solitude or uh, they just wanted you to keep growing slowly. That's all it was. And and they're they're a devil. They're trapped up in their addictions and uh, they can't clean up their subconscious the way you did. That's why people see you as a uh, wish fulfillment, you know, nine of cups. Uh, this, these people just wanting to quarrel, make quarrels so you wouldn't be happy, but they can't knock you off your happy. And what happened, what's going on is well of fortune karma. You know, this is a, uh, you ended out that cycle, you know, and uh, you're, you're, you've, you've healed. And this person is lazy and they're still in their nightmare. They're still in their nightmares. But, they, they can't tell their truths. That's why. And, uh, and, uh, you know, in your home, and you're getting ready to receive abundance. And, uh, because you, you got a new point of view, you actually feel remorse for things that you've done. Aquar Aquarius energy come out, Venus in Aquarius. And, you know, you're perfecting your life at the moment. This is about a loss crisis, you know. So you, you've had to lose a lot of things in, in in your family, and that's why that came out. And you, you was protected, uh, and your intuition was warning you a danger with these people, and that's why you felt setbacks in in your life, you know. And, and you accepted them, and you took a risk to gamble on yourself. And and uh, here we got five of five of wands and remember there's all they're they're always in the background trying to figure out what they can do next to freak with you i mean this is saturn leo energy and it, and and it, this was just always a competition they always wanted to argue and be in conflict so what about under a real empress nurturing loving giving people abundant yeah they 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 love thinking about all these memories with you because they wish that they hadn't doubted you because they know you're a true loving caring faithful woman empress whether you're married or you're a single empress they know you're true and you're very creative because you're a true magician and i am and i thank you for that spirit this is mercury beth energy and you know your gifts come from the divine it ain't magic man you know you had the willpower to overcome all this shit this is about free will and, and choosing your choosing yourself over others. You know, you got the potential to to persuade anybody if you wanted to. You 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 can you took the initiative. You know, somebody might have been. Uh, this was about prejudice, hesitation, indecision. Somebody just they didn't want you to succeed in nothing, but it doesn't matter. And it was whoever these cold beings was that wanted dominion over your life that went around telling telling things that w went on in your life and it, it wasn't even your partner and, and that's why and that's why them uh, ones them, these ten of wands these burdens was on your backs but you trans this is about transformation you transform you transmuted all that energy into building your business that's why you're going to be a success and feel fulfillment you know but you, you was looking for fulfillment outside of yourself because you was just attracted to someone and maybe you was oppressed. You, you, you was holding on to them old, old feelings and old things that people had done to you. But looky here, baby. Hang on. <laughs> but you, you went inside, you went in hermit mode and you started doing the healing to learn to love yourself and the universe wanted you to stop loving other people more than yourself and you know and, and and now your emperor is a very strong loving loyal father that works very hard daily he's a, in a good man it's hard to find this is Ari Zaddy and uh you know your emperor is very stable and strong and uh they do things rationally and their equilibrium is is uh intact and this is about they want to protect you and uh you got through all that ad adversity that you got off through all that adversity because you went into hermit mode and you had to silently detach you know and, and let go of all those secrets and self-sacrifice you know that's why you feel stagnant but look what come out look 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 emperor and emperor us the emperor and emperor us
So what it means is, your, your, your whoever smaller beer is, they love you. And you're their two of cups. This is about, uh, you're all in a gestation period and you're all tied to each other from the beginning of time, baby. You, you got a passion for each other and there's always gonna be jealousy and betrayal because this is your spiritual partnership. There's always gonna be jealousy and betrayal and people's gonna always be mad at it. And that's the whole gist of this reading and I hope it helps somebody out here today because somebody loves you out here big. And let me get you a little love message. I am looking at you guys. Let me get you a little love message. Let me get two. And let me get another. Let me, let me get another. Let me find them. Let me pull out one more. Oh. Oh, well, I pulled out the planets. Hang on. I pulled out the wrong ones. Hang on. Let me get you another one. And another one. All right. So here's what we got. We got commitment. And commitment is an important factor to achieve a successful relationship. You and your person are committed to each other. Nobody can break it, okay? Cherish. Cherish this relationship. I do. I cherish mine. I love them. I love my partner so much. And synchronicity, a divine soul counterpart relationship is blessed with amazing moments. Synchronicity, it is. And when my partner comes home from work, uh, I promise every night when we get around each other, we got one light in here. And, and I've actually heard, I ain't gonna get into it because nobody don't believe things like that, but I'm telling you something that happens, my, these lights will go do -do 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 -do. When we get close together, that light, it'll just start telling things, it does. Notice synchronicities, notice them numbers, notice notice things that's different, you know, because that's your true person, and, and that's all I've got you guys, and I hope it helps somebody out here. I thought it was a pretty good reading. Hope y'all like my cards. If you like my cards, hit like, please. And hit subscribe, and I love you, and I just hope you like my little cards. If you like my little devil, look at my little devil. Oh, wow. Because, you know, you're a true magician. You're a true magician, empress and emperor out here, and all these people that want to keep you up in your nightmares, it didn't work because your old man and, or your, your old man or your old woman, they still love you so much, and, and they want to make new memories for you. They don't care about all this backstab a trail. We all got to endure shit. The thing is, if you can work through those challenges and get through it together, and you did, and, and you're all going to prosper for it, so don't worry. And I love you guys so very much, and I hope this helps in pieces, pieces, and 37, 37. Woo! 10, 10, giant buses come to me and you. Woo! Love you guys. Peace.